Today on The Marketing Hub, we're going to talk about what good marketing actually accomplishes for businesses. And I'm delighted to say we have marketing consultant Lisa McPhillips from Dynamic Marketing here. Hi, Lisa. Hello. How are you, Paul? Thanks for having me on today. And thanks for joining us, Lisa. So, Lisa, I'm going to get straight into it. Lisa, what is marketing? Well, for me, Paul, marketing is about bringing people to your front door and having them interested enough in you to ring your doorbell. And then sales takes over and sales brings those people into the kitchen, makes them a cup of tea, makes them all comfy. And then together, sales and marketing work again to bring them into the living room, light the fire, open that bottle of wine, get the nibblies out, and they are never leaving you. They are in for the night. That's what marketing is. And Lisa, I love that analogy, by the way. <laughs> uh, it's really good. Uh, Lisa, and how are you seeing businesses using marketing at the moment? Well, that's a, a great question, Paul. And to be honest with you, from talking to business owners, I really do think a lot of uh, businesses out there aren't maximizing marketing to the best. And again, from talking to business owners, I think a lot of it is around a mis. Um, a misunderstanding as to what marketing actually is. So at a very high level, good marketing will help you identify who your target audience is and what their challenges are, what their pain points are, so that you can provide a good solution to them. It will also help you identify who your competitors are, which is very important, right? So who are they talking to? What are they saying? So that, again, you can stand out from them. You can set yourself apart. And it's about putting all that together into a really good marketing plan that will attract prospects into your sales funnel, bring them through, convert them through into leads, into paying customers. And then, again, a trick a lot of business owners are missing out on is that retention. So how can you make sure that they're always going to remain customers with you for life? And marketing really is about finding a good mixture of different activities that will help you achieve all that. And again, I'm seeing a lot of businesses focus in on one specific area, maybe social media or maybe they do ad hoc tactical campaigns. Really, you can't put all your eggs in the one basket. A good marketing plan will have a mix of digital, social and traditional methods um, and activities that have the long-term goal of, of helping you achieve your overall business goals and objectives. So is that adding revenue to the bottom line? Is it increasing your brand awareness? It's very important that you know ahead of time what those goals are, and then you can run your marketing um, to, to deliver on those. But another key thing to remember is really for the best results, marketing needs a long-term approach. If you're going to kind of do ad hoc, short, quick, sharp, you're not going to get the, the, the long-term effects that good marketing can give you. Okay, so, and, and that sums it up very well, actually, that I, you have to be in for the long term. That's fantastic, Lisa. And Lisa, just before we go, could you tell us a little bit about dynamic, dynamic marketing uh, and the, the clients that you have and how people can contact you? Sure, thanks so much. So yes, dynamic marketing. Um, I'm available at Lisa, L-I-S-S-A, at dynamicmarketing.ie. And my website is dynamicmarketing.ie. I'm also on LinkedIn, so please do reach out and connect with me. I work with clients of all different sizes, um, predominantly in the IT and financial services space. Um, but I do have clients in other areas as well. And I offer a range of facilities. I can work, I can act as your outsourced CMO, which um, a lot of my clients like. Um, they don't have in-house marketing or maybe they've got junior staff who need a little bit of guidance every now and then. And I can come in and again, be that liaison between senior management and the marketing team to make sure, as I spoke about before, the overall business goals and objectives are being delivered upon. Um, I can also work on a project by project basis. Um, and I also have some retainer clients. So it really is about okay. finding the mixture that works best for each business owner and delivers for the business. That's great, Lisa. Thanks very much for joining us today. Thanks a lot, Paul, for having me. I really enjoyed it.